Hey guys, good morning or afternoon, whichever time that you're watching this. I hope you guys are having an amazing day so far. I didn't get to actually intro this video when I was filming, so I figured I would go ahead and just intro it right now. I'm actually editing this video right now as you're watching this clip. I didn't do a lot of talking in the beginning of my video, as you will notice. I just wanted to kind of give you guys a small little update before the video starts. I love this vlog, first of all. I put a lot of effort and work into this vlog, so I really hope you guys enjoy it. It's pretty exciting. I really like it, but I did want to give you guys just a small little life update. I actually started grad school. I'm doing my master's in Homeland Security, so I got my bachelor's degree in criminal justice, and so now I'm actually doing my master's in Homeland Security. I also currently work at a prison, so I'm a correctional officer for a prison here in Huntsville, which is where I live and go to school at, Sam Houston. Basically what I'm doing right now is I'm taking two classes and working 48 hours a week at the prison. I'm taking Foundations of Homeland Security and I'm also taking Unconventional Threats, which is just like a terrorism class. And I'm doing two classes right now because it's my first semester in the graduate program, so I didn't wanna do three classes and just kinda overload myself, as well as working 48 hours a week with YouTube and the other extra stuff that I do on the side. That is kind of my little life update for you guys. Another thing that I haven't mentioned on my YouTube is that I got a hedgehog. My hedgehog's name is Coco. I'm gonna get her right now to show you guys really quickly before I begin this video. All right, you guys, so I'm back. This is Coco. She is my hedgehog. I believe she's about 12 or 13 weeks now. She's tiny, she fits in my hand and she is very anti-social. I actually just woke her up from her nap. I think I already said that, so she's not gonna be too happy about it. But she's very anti-social. She is nocturnal, so she sleeps like 95% of her life. But when I do get to bring her out and play, she's super playful, and I just love her so much. Her name's Coco. It's short for coconut. Yeah, this is Coco, my hedgehog. I love her so much. If you guys have any questions about Coco, leave them down below. And without further ado, Coco says, let's get started with this video. This is my outfit. I'm wearing this 90 degrees tank top. These tealish. I don't even know what color these are. They're really pretty. My Nike shoes and my room's a mess, but just ignore that because when I get back, I'm going to clean my room. I'm heading to campus. I'm going to be doing some homework and I figured I would just bring you guys along with me. That's a really dark. Kind of looks like it's going to rain.
also I couldn't find what I needed at Hobby Lobby so I came to Walmart and I also couldn't find what I needed so I actually decided to just get myself some stuff that I did need so I did need some cotton rounds so I went ahead and got these and then I haven't tried this before the Cetaphil I got the extra gentle daily scrub just looks like this I have this square bottle the what is it called cleanser i think and i also got this uh degree very cool deodorant because i needed some deodorant so i got that i also got this facial cleansing brush it just looks like this it was like eight dollars um i got two of these little guys for work so i can fill them up with some soap and then one with some hand sanitizer i work at a prison so the things that we bring in have to be in a clear container so these were about 97 cents each so they were about two dollars total i went ahead and got this vaseline uh creme brulee vaseline it's super super tiny really really cute so I got this and then I got this plant pot holder thing for my succulent. My succulent is in a pot right now that doesn't have a drainage hole and so this one has a drainage hole and I really needed a drainage hole for my succulent. The one that it's in right now doesn't have one which is not good. It'll make their roots rot if water just stays there so I'm really happy that I finally got a pot that has the little drainage this is the normal one that i have right now it doesn't have a drainage or anything so i'm gonna take it out and put it in this one it's a lot bigger but it's gonna be okay quickly wanted to show you guys my plants so as you saw in the clip I repotted my cactus and I actually have these two little guys so I put it in here this one used to be in this pot and I transferred it over to this one as you guys saw in the clip and then I went ahead and just repotted the cactus and put it in this one yesterday i actually bought this plant and i really don't know the name of it so if you know what kind of plant this is please let me know down below also got this little guy yesterday at heb it is also a succulent it's just in this brown pot and i need to get it its own little pot so i'm really excited to replant this one but i did just get this one and this one yesterday the day before yesterday, I got this orchid at Kroger. It's in this pink blush, really pretty pink blush pot. This one's just a white orchid, so it's really, really pretty. And I just keep it next to this other orchid that I have. But honestly, this orchid right here is not doing too hot, which is why I got this little guy. As you can tell, it kind of just dried out on the stem part. The leaves down here are still doing pretty good. They're not bad at all like the leaves down here are doing great it's just this stem part that is completely like i'm sure it's dead maybe there's like no growth at all coming through if you guys have any advice on this little guy please let me know down below if you know anything about orchids because i don't want to throw it away if it's still alive and good because like i said the leaves down here are doing great and there is some new growth right there you can see that little leaf peeking through that is some new growth for the orchid the only issue that i have is with the stem so i'm gonna go ahead and just end off this video right here thank you guys so much for watching i really hope you guys enjoyed follow me on social media i will leave my social media's link down below and make sure to subscribe if you are new here and i will see you guys in the next one Bye bye